In this video, my goal is to use scientific research to convince you that you have the power to rewire your brain to become a better athlete. Your brain is an organ made up of millions of circuits and cells called neurons and glial cells. These circuits and cells reorganize themselves depending on your thoughts, actions, and experiences. Scientific research and experiments have identified principles of why the brain rewires itself. I'm going to explain these principles to show you how much power you have to shape your brain if you were to make a conscious decision and effort to do so. Principle number one is practice makes perfect. It has been found that enhanced stimulation of a body part enlarges its cortical representational zones and may change its topographic order. Essentially, what this is saying is that the more you practice something, the larger the area responsible for it in the brain will become. For example, an experiment showed that practicing reading with your fingers can lead to structural and functional changes in your brain. Also, it has been found that the areas of your brain responsible for sensation of fingers are larger in string players than in non-musicians. Basically, this is how sensation is represented in the brain of a typical human. The hands, for example, have many nerve endings, so they take up a larger amount of space in the brain. Same thing with the face, tongue, feet, and so on. However, this does not look the same for everyone. As I previously mentioned, string musicians have larger brain representation for the hand they pick the strings with. Following this same logic, a soccer player is likely to have larger representation for the legs, a basketball player a larger representation for the hands, and so on. The main point is that changes do occur in your brain due to lots of practice and repetition. Principle number two is use it or lose it. A permanent competition for cortical space enlarges those areas that are supplied by important information and leads to narrowing of others. This is essentially saying that different parts of your brain are constantly competing for space. And the more you use a part of your brain, the stronger and more efficient it will become. The opposite is also true. If you stop practicing something for an extended period of time, that will lead to the narrowing of that part of the brain. The key takeaways from this video is that you have the power to choose your thoughts and actions to shape your brain. However, like working out to strengthen your muscles, rewiring your brain requires that you exercise it with different strategies and through lots of repetition. Although I only talked about rewiring your brain to perform movements in this video, similar principles apply to rewiring your brain to improve your focus, to think positively, to reduce chronic pain, and to create other good habits. On this channel, I'll be showing you how all of this is possible and I'll be sharing the strategies used by the best athletes and sports psychologists in the world to help you rewire your brain and become a better athlete. That's all for this video. Give me a thumbs up and comment below if you enjoyed it and subscribe to get the best strategies for elite performance. Thanks for watching.